Well, as the bicycle mayor, you are the human face of cycling in the city. You give the right example every time when you're riding the bike, but you're also showing that it's just fun. I'm now talking to city hall, so the government, uh, people that live in Amsterdam, tourists, engineering companies, commercial companies, actually everyone who needs to get involved talking about the bicycle. So I became the bicycle mayor of Amsterdam just by making this little video, putting it on the internet. There was this, this competition going on and uh, I got a lot of uh, public votes for it. And since I was in the top four of them, I was invited to join the uh, conference and to give a pitch. And by doing that, I was chosen by a panel uh, to become the first bicycle mayor of the world and of Amsterdam, the city itself. I definitely think a bike mayor would be a huge, huge, huge thing for New York City. They would be the liaison between the cyclists and everyone who makes these decisions. I think that someone who can speak to all of the different things that cycling can bring to a community, whether it be health benefits or kind of community building. That person could really send messages about the culture what, what it is and what it should be. And I think that would be a very good thing because it would come from one of the bicyclists saying, this is the way you should behave. I organized two hackathons uh, to create some new ideas around cycling. It was a cooperation with citizens and just companies who want to join. And we created actually some really nice ideas and we are going to experiment those ideas in the next couple of years. I want to shift together with Cycle Space, the NGO I'm working for. We want to shift the cities from car-centering back to human-centric. We have this goal in mind, 50 by 30. So 50% of all rides should be done by bike in every city around the world by 2030. An interesting idea would be like being a sort of liaison between community boards or council members and like bicyclists, you know, just take them on a bike ride. What they could contribute is probably really articulating what the value of cycling is and kind of its role in a sustainable city, moving people more quickly and safely. Being here in New York, I'm exploring uh, opportunities for a bicycle mayor program and for a bicycle mayor of, for New York City. Uh, what I've seen so far is that a bicycle mayor could help a lot and a bicycle mayor could inspire everyone in the city who isn't cycling yet to by just giving the right example and showing how much fun cycling is. We do need a bike mayor in New York City because cycling implicates so many different types of issues across so many different departments with different responsibilities in New York City government. What a great idea to have one person pull it all together, have oversight, and make sure that this mode of transportation, which holds such great promise for our city, gets the support and understanding and coordination it needs. There should absolutely be a bike mayor. I'd like to volunteer to be bike mayor if there is a job position open. I'm not the only one anymore, so we also have a bicycle mayor in Rio, uh, in Sao Paulo, in Mexico City, and in Sydney as well. And we will organize the first annual Bicycle Mayor Summit, the 10th and 11th of June 2017. And uh, all the bicycle mayors around the world will come together to start the global community of bicycle mayors.